Malumak kay maet sa kapatid. My name is Malumak. No one can imagine how much Jehovah has helped me. I was raised in Sisimiut in Greenland. My childhood was wonderful. We were very often out in nature. In the summer we sailed, and in the winter we rode dog sledge, and we went hunting and fishing. When I was a child, I was very close to my parents. I was a daddy's girl. He called me my beloved. So, beloved became my nickname. It has been so wonderful to be raised in the truth. The greatest gift that I could get is to know Jehovah through them. When I was nine years old, my parents got divorced. It was terrible. I saw how my siblings were hurt. It cannot be explained how, I mean, we were very wounded in our hearts. When my parents divorced, my father was disfellowshipped. It was very hard to be separated like that. I missed my dad a lot. When my mom started to drink, I also felt abandoned. Because I knew what she had been doing, I was not surprised when after some time she was disfellowshipped. But of course I felt very hurt and sad. I supplicated Jehovah to help me stay in the truth. The pioneer sister that studied with me helped me a lot. She studied with me, sometimes took me on the ministry and invited me to dinner. When I was about 12 years old, my father came back into the truth. I was very happy that it finally happened. I began to have a good relationship with him again. We sailed a lot, drove snowmobile and rode dog sledge. And my father and I watched movies in the evening. I remember that when my dad heard that I was going to be baptized, he shed a tear and I could see he was proud. When I was 15 years old, my world fell to pieces. My father committed suicide. It's difficult to describe that my father was suddenly gone. I can't understand why he would do such a selfish thing. I missed him a lot. It was it was like my heart was stabbed. I was also very angry at him. I wrote a lot. And I wrote many letters to my father about things I wanted to tell him. I also cried out to Jehovah in long prayers. I love Psalm 34:18 about Jehovah being close to those who are crushed in spirit. That was how I felt, and the thought that Jehovah is close to them comforts me a lot. I also did all I could to go to all the meetings, even, even when I didn't want to see anyone. Even if I'd cried before the meeting, I went anyway. One month after my father's death, I got baptized. I got baptized because I loved Jehovah. When I was nine years old, I had promised Jehovah to serve him for the rest of my life. My relationship with my mother is much better now. It is great to serve Jehovah together with her now. We preach together every Sunday and I always look forward to going on the ministry together with her. When I was 18 years old, I began to help in the remote translation office. Later, I started pioneering. I have always learned a lot from King David. No matter what circumstance he faced, whether bad or good, he used them to draw close to Jehovah.
Jehovah has helped me to overcome challenges through the congregation, giving me power beyond what is normal, taking me in as his daughter. <laughs>